Dear fellow scholars, this is Two Minute Papers with Károly Zsolnai Fehér. I am sure that every one of us have overheard conversations at the workplace where people talked about taking the stairs instead of the elevator and, as a result, getting leaner. There was also a running joke on the internet about Arnold Classic, a famous bodybuilding competition slash festival where I think it's fair to say that people tended to favor the escalator instead of the stairs. So, this is it. We're going to settle this here and now. Do we get lean from taking the stairs every day? Scientists set up a controlled experiment where over a hundred subjects climbed 11 stories of staircases, ascending a total of 27 meters vertically. Their oxygen consumption and heart rate was measured, and most importantly for us, the amount of calorie cost of this undertaking. They have found that all this self-flagellation with ascending 11 stories of staircases burns a whopping 19.7 kilocalories. Each step is worth approximately one-tenth of a kilocalorie if we are ascending. Descending is worth approximately half of that. Apparently, these bodybuilders know what they are doing. The authors diplomatically noted, stair climbing exercise using a local public access staircase met the minimum requirements for cardiorespiratory benefits and can therefore be considered a viable exercise for most people and suitable for promotion of physical activity. Which sounds like the scientific equivalent of basically, well, better than nothing. So does this mean that you shouldn't take the stairs at work? If you are looking to get lean because of that, no. Not a chance. However, if you are looking for a refreshing cardiovascular exercise in the morning that refreshes your body and makes you happier, start climbing. I do it all the time and I love it. We are exploring so far uncharted territories and this makes the first episode on nutrition in the series. If you would like to hear more of this, let me know in the comment section. I'd also be happy to see your paper recommendations in nutrition as well. Thanks for watching and for your generous support, and I'll see you next time.